Okay, so we're going to have a look at a Coldplay riff, uh, Adventure of a Lifetime. The reason why I've put this uh, cap on, because I know a lot of people might not have electric guitars, so when you play up here an electric guitar, it's really nice, the strings are nice close to the fret and it's really easy to get around. But when you've got an acoustic, it's nice down here, but the strings are normally quite far away from the frets and it's really hard to get any lead going so because this riff is just at the top I put this on here and it just pushes these strings close to the fretboard so you can sort of practice electric guitar licks with with a bit of ease on an acoustic so it's a good little tip there uh, I'm going to demonstrate it first so I'll just do it slow Okay, so it's a nice little riff to get fast. Let's see if I can do it quicker. Okay, it would be a lot easier on an electric, but it's not too bad with the capo on. Uh, so, all right, this is what it looks like. Quite intimidating, but a lot of it's repetitive. Let's just go to the first line. Let's go to the first very lick. So you can see here on the E string, the thin string, we've got 17, 12, 17, 12. So that is this little, it sounds like a big stretch, but because the frets are so small, it's not too bad. So 17 is here. And 12 is the one with the two dots. The next dot up is uh, 15 and then 17. So you could pick them individually. Okay, uh, let's go back to the riff. And then it goes 15 on the second string, and then 12 on the first string again, and then 15, 13. So yeah, I'll just zone in on that. So I'll just play you that. Last little bit of that first line is on the third string you go 14 12 14 12 so I'll show you what that looks like Does it again? So it plays that twice. You can see on the music, it's even though it looked daunting when you actually analyse it now, that's just a repetition of this. Okay, so I'm going to go to the third line, and it is pretty similar, but it, the only difference is the first four notes are 15, 12, but so. Show you what that looks like. And then the same. So it's the same as that. So the third line. So it's just that that change changes. Okay, so the very last line is got a little different thing at the end. Let's go down here. So that it is 15, 12. So we just do 1, 14, 12 instead of. Uh, you see on the third line it goes 14 12 14 12 here you go 14 12 so i'm going to play that and stop it stop at the 14 12 so so just practice that and then on the first string you go 19 20. so and what I was doing when I was playing it, I was doing an octave thing to fatten it out, so. so but you can just play them two notes, 19, 20. You've probably never used the last note on your guitar before, so.
Okay, hope you enjoyed that. Nice little riff. Uh, nice to play something up here uh, and high pitched rather than always riffs down here. So, hope you enjoyed that. Let me know what you think. Uh, au revoir.